Good evening, I'm Antonia Singut. Former Prime Ministers Sir Michael Samari and Sir Mekere Maralta have expressed concerns over articles published by an Australian media outlet regarding the country's debt associated with the UBS loan. Australia's Fairfax reported that PNG is facing a debt crisis as a result of the $1.2 billion UBS loan, which was obtained to buy the 10.1% shares in Oil Search Limited. But Prime Minister Pete O'Neill today raised questions about the credibility of the articles, describing it as an obvious conflict of interest between a Fairfax journalist who published the story and the two former Prime Ministers. Gabriel Bigger reports. Following the article published by the Australia's Fairfax and other media, the two former Prime Ministers held a joint news conference in Port Mosby on Monday to raise their concerns regarding the media reports. The media reports highlight on processes and procedures relating to the state's accusation of the $1.2 billion loan from UBS and the debt implications as a result. Former Prime Minister and ECP Governor Sir Michael Somare says the article leaves questions to be answered. Information revealed publicly in the past few days raised many questions about $1.2 billion loan for the government to buy 10% shareholding in oil search and shows that uh, it has had a severe adverse impact on the nation's finances. Sir Michael came out publicly on this issue after his disassociation with the National Alliance Party, which is a coalition to the government, and his referral of Prime Minister Peter O'Neill to the Ombudsman Commission over the 2011 political impasse. In a joint news conference, another former Prime Minister, Sir Mekere Morauta, raised similar concerns on the article published in the Australian medium. In my view, the tripartite, the triangle transaction, nation buying share, oil share shares, financed by UPS, is certainly not in the national interest. But Prime Minister Peter O'Neill, in a media statement, raised questions about the article. He described it as a conflict of interest in the reporting by the Fairfax journalist who he says draws into question balance and credibility. He said the actions of the reporter have been shameful in pushing attempts by Semekere and Sir Michael to destabilize PNG politics, adding that the two former Prime Ministers have connections with the Fairfax journalist and his family. Mr. O'Neill described the public outcry by the two former Prime Ministers as politics leading up to the next parliament sitting at the end of this month. The Prime Minister said the UBS loan transaction matters are before the court and the comments on matters before the court will not be entered into until proceedings have run their course. Gerald Bego, NBC National News, Port Moresby.